Uh, my name is Guillaume Cano. I'm a physician uh, and a scientist. I'm working uh, in Paris at Necker Hospital. Uh, and I'm taking care of patients with, with uh, pix 3 c alpha gain of function mutation. It's a rare disorder that affects probably one patient over 20,000 uh, uh, in the general population. And that kind of disorders uh, uh, are leading to uh, overgrowth syndrome, so um, different type of malformation that affects only uh, uh, some part of the body and some tissue layers. So uh, that kind of disorders are due to genetic mutation that are occurring during the embryonic development. We are talking about gain of function mutation uh, that lead to cell growth and cell proliferation. So according to the moment where this mutation will occur, you may have some different part of your body that can be affected and some tissue layers uh, that can be affected differently. Some patients are presenting with just an isolated lesion like a macrodactyly, or sometimes it's more complex, the brain is involved. So we are talking about hemimegalencephaly or complete megalencephaly. And sometimes this is the entire body that is affected and we talk about cloth syndrome. So I would say that more than 80% of the uh, body is affected. But we don't really understand everything right now. Um, that kind of mutation is really occurring during the embryonic development, meaning that the parents are not carrying the mutation. It's not inherited, and this is not transmissible. Uh, it's only affecting a small part of the body or a major part of the body, but again, it's not transmissible. We don't know why you have that kind of mutation that occurred during the embryonic development. Probably this gene is highly susceptible to some spontaneous mutation because in fact this gene is frequently affected in cancer it's a mutation that we can detect in breast cancer in colon cancer in thyroid cancer so it's a, a gene that has some susceptibility some degree of susceptibility uh, for spontaneous mutation i would say but why these mutations are occurring along this gene we don't know